Hi guys, welcome to Angel Speaks. In this video, I'm going to talk about toxic people. What is a toxic person? A toxic person is not a very healthy person to be around for long periods of time. There are people that the longer you're around them, you start to feel irritated because um, they're always so negative or they're always just disagreeing with you. It don't matter what it is. You could say it's cold. They'll be like, nah, it's not cold. They just want to disagree. They want to put you down. They want to try to, everything's a competition with toxic people. Um, toxic people always have a negative outlook in life. They will um, always have doubts or just, they'll, they'll rain on your parade. If you're having a good day, they're going to try to damper it. They're going to try to, you know, you will randomly ever, you, you will rarely ever see them with a smile on their face. They'll be pretty serious or or looking just down or or just have like a a look of contempt. Like they, they're not happy people. These people are pretty miserable deep inside and they 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 want to express that through hurting others and they will put people down. Toxic people will make fun of people a lot. They will um They'll be sarcastic. They'll put you down and try to act like, oh, I was just joking. But they'll keep doing it over and over. Toxic people do not respect boundaries. And they lack, <clears throat> depending on how toxic they are, they will lack empathy and remorse. These are two components that you really need to have, be able to have healthy relationships with people. So toxic people, they lack those two things. Empathy is basically feeling um, you're putting yourself in the other person's shoes and imagining how that person feels. And at that moment, you're able to feel that way a little bit. And, and, and that's basically connecting, being able to connect emotionally to other people. Toxic people lack that connection and awareness because they are too, too self-absorbed. They're too much in themselves. They they're not able to relate or connect to other people. Um, and remorse is feeling bad for doing something. They don't feel bad for doing things because they'll keep on doing it. It doesn't matter what they say. They could sit there and say, I'm so sorry or whatever have you. It doesn't matter because people's actions will confirm if their words are true or not. And they, they don't feel nothing. And so um, they're going to keep at it. They will drain you of all your energy. They, they, they carry dark clouds over their heads. And so these type of people you really have to avoid because um, their demeanor is very contagious. And you can be the most optimistic, strong person, but um, you stay around someone long enough like that and it's going to affect you and it's going to drain you. Um, they will drain you. You will feel very low in energy when you're around these people or you'll feel agitated. Um, they like to push buttons. They love drama. They will always be about drama. And it's a pattern with them. You'll notice they're always starting drama. Um, yeah, so um, life is too short to surround yourself around negative people. So please just be around positive people with positive energy, people that make you feel energized and happy and inspired. Why waste time surrounding yourself around people that are literally out to put you down and bring you down and drag you to, to their level of how miserable they are? Um, avoid these people best as best as you can. And if you're with someone that is toxic, please really, really think about, rethink being with them because um, they will, your health is at stake. And when you're around these people on a daily basis, especially, that's going to really, really mess with your health. Stress really will mess your body up. And so um, it's really important. Take care of yourself, take care of your body, love yourself, respect yourself. If you're with someone that can't respect your boundaries, they are not worthy to be around, okay? Thank you. Please feel free to comment. Let me know if this video was helpful to you. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask, and I'll try to help out the best I can. Okay, stay tuned. More to come.